What's going up everybody? It's Chini the Great back for another update video. So today, um, to be quite honest with you guys, I haven't written hardly that much at all. I wrote a little bit at the beginning of the week, but I've just been so crazy busy at work. Like, I haven't had a day off in a few days, and my next day off is the day after tomorrow, so I'll definitely be catching up on writing. But yeah, I've just been so busy at work, and... It's like longer shifts that are in the middle of the day, so it's like I wake up and get ready for work, go to work, come home, and then I have a couple hours before I have to go to sleep, and I'm too tired anyway to try to write. So that's where it's been at. Today I have a later shift, so I'm going to try to write after I post this video. Um, after I get ready for work, if I still have enough time, then I'll definitely write. And maybe tonight, if I'm not too tired, I can write a little bit too, because it is a shorter shift. So yeah, and then the day after tomorrow. So I'm still where I've been at in that second new chapter. And I haven't really decided, I know what the goal of the chapter should be, but I haven't decided like the details or the little, the subplot, I guess, for that chapter. So I should be figuring that all out this week. And I'm sorry that I haven't written. Um, like I said, it's just been hectic at work and I get too tired to write. So, for this video, I wanted to kind of tell you guys, since I haven't, like, I don't have a big update on the novel, I just wanted to tell you guys why I make videos, because I haven't really explained it at all, and, um, I might as well, you know? <laughs> so, the reason I started making videos is because, well, I wanted to make videos for a long time, and still now, I have plans for this channel to be more than just writing updates, and, um, Really, I just like the idea of sharing my life on YouTube and sharing my life with you guys, whatever I'm doing in my life, just putting it out there to share with you guys. And no matter what I end up doing in life, I know that whatever I'll be doing, I think can be inspirational to someone else. So that's a huge part of it. No matter if it's writing and becoming a novelist or something else, something like skateboarding which haha I suck at skateboarding but you know even if I share with other people that I suck at skateboarding but I can get better maybe that can inspire some kid who wants to skateboard or even something like art or drawing or making pottery anything like that like or anything that I can't even believe right now that I haven't even thought about maybe you know life throws so much stuff at you and you end up in places you never thought you'd be so no matter where that place is that I'll be, I know that I can inspire someone through that. And that's why I want to share on YouTube because no matter what I end up doing, I feel like someone can watch my journey and my videos and be inspired. And I hope that's the case. So right now I've decided to go with writing, writing updates because Sorry if I sound weird, I just woke up, but I've decided to go with writing updates because that's what's currently going on in my life is just out of college, working, and writing my first novel. And, you know, who knows? Maybe I could become a very successful novelist and have many books that do well. And I can look back, myself, I can look back on these videos, this little video diary, and see how it started out and see what I was feeling at that time and what I was going through and the progress that I've made since then and I think that's incredible and I think many people should do that in some way whether it be videos or blogging or uh, just keeping an actual diary anything that you can do or that you want to do to kind of document your progress I guess and document your feelings and your emotions at a certain period in life I think that is awesome and it's certainly something I want to look back on and even if this never gets any like more than the subscribers I have now I'm fine with that honestly because I mean I hope someone watches this and feels inspired but even if no one ever does it's cool for me to go back and watch it so when I'm in a different place not so much now where I'm still doing the same things but um, years from now or something like that or when I've, maybe <laughs> I'll be, I don't know, in an office building working as a CEO or something. I don't know anything. And then I can look back on this and be like, yeah, 
yeah, I remember trying to write that novel, but you know, that's that's why I keep these videos and that's why I keep making these videos is right now to inspire people with writing. And I think I definitely want to put different content, even if I'm still making writing videos to add more content to this channel, um, to just reach a larger group of people and just show my different interests. You know, writing isn't the only thing I do. So I would love to do that. I would love to film vlogs, honestly, but there's only two reasons that I'm not doing that right now. And one is because I still have such crappy editing and filming software that the vlog would just come out really sloppy and glitchy and I don't want that. And I guess um, my camera is fine to use for that because many people use that, but the editing, I don't want little glitches in between every scene. So. Uh, that's one reason I haven't started filming vlogs and the second reason is because my life is not interesting at the moment and no one will want to watch it. You know, my life pretty much right now is wake up, get ready for work, do some chores around the house, um, go to work, come home from work and relax or write and do it again the next day. That's pretty much, and you guys are seeing most of that anyway, so I don't think it would make much sense to film a vlog about it. I have tried filming one vlog before and it's harder than it looks like you think it would be easy to just carry a camera around with you everywhere you go but there's so much editing when you're filming everything that you're doing in a day first off knowing when to film and when not to film is just difficult because the editing it's the editing is cumbersome so you don't want to walk around and film every single thing and then delete hours and hours of footage but you also don't want to miss anything, you know? You want the vlog to flow well and show what you're doing that day, but yeah, I tried and it was just, I don't know. I don't think I filmed the right stuff. And it was it was a day where I had a lot to do and I planned it out and so it was going to be a little bit more interesting than just like, um, you know, going to work or something. But yeah, I, I couldn't, I don't, I don't think I filmed the right stuff and I couldn't edit it that well. And also... People who vlog in public and talk to a camera in public have balls because that shit is scary. I did it for like one day and still I was very nervous to like film in front of people. And <laughs> I don't know why. It's not so much that I, that I look stupid because I probably look stupid with or without a camera. But, <laughs> but it was just like I didn't want people to think I was conceited because I was talking to a camera or I was filming myself, you know. But... I guess I should just get over that and film, but, uh, yeah, so that's why I haven't started filming vlogs, because my days aren't that interesting anyway. But, you know, maybe when I have better editing software, which should be soon, my birthday is coming up, and maybe, maybe my dad can give me a new laptop <laughs> if he wants, or maybe, I don't know, I don't think my mom can, but, I don't know, if they can't, which I totally understand if my parents can't buy me that, but... I should, I've been making making those stacks, that fat retail stacks, you know what I mean? But I should be able to get one, at least in a couple months, and I know that seems far away, but I don't think it'll be too long from now, and I can get my own laptop, so that'd be cool, and then I can get new editing software, so that's what I'm excited for, but I think once I get editing software, like better editing software, I'm gonna play around with all types of different videos, because, you know, I just, I like making videos and I like editing and I would like to expand my channel you know and I think I don't know not so much skit videos uh, but vlogging or I don't know like like I said skate videos even if that's just like more of to be funny because I'm not that great of a skater I think that would still be cool and make even if it's just a silly video you know but yeah different types of videos um, I just even if I end up quitting writing, which I hope I never do, I still want to have this channel and just share my life on YouTube. So no matter where life takes me or what I end up doing, I just want to inspire people. And if YouTube is the way to do that, then I want to do YouTube. So yeah, not so much to be like my career or anything, but definitely a cool hobby. And I just want to inspire people no matter what I end up doing and keep a document of my progress. So that is why I make these videos. And uh, yeah, I know a few of you like it, and <laughs> only very few, but I think 
I don't know. If you stick around, um, there'll probably be way more videos and different types of videos. But yeah, right now I'm sticking with writing and I love writing. So if that's what I'm going to film, then that's what I'm going to film. But yeah, so I'm sorry that I haven't written this much this week. But um, yeah, on the day after tomorrow, I have a day off. So I'm definitely going to catch up because, you know, those couple off days in the week really is like... <laughs> it makes you value your time because you don't have any time the rest of the week, so writing as much as I can in those days is really important and that's a priority on my off days, so yeah. So I'll keep writing and I promise you I'll have a better update next uh, next week. And I'm still toying with the idea of upload times. Um, my boss just told me he's going to put me on rotation, which means I'll have the same schedule every single week so I'm waiting to get that to see when I want to post so yeah um, I'll see you guys next week and I'll keep writing and I'll try to find more time throughout the week to write and I'll keep making videos about whatever I'm doing and hopefully it inspires someone out there so that's the that's the whole goal that and looking back at progress is the goal of my videos so I'll stick with it and I hope you guys keep working on whatever you guys are working on and um, as long as you're doing something that you want to do and you're getting closer to your goals, it honestly does not matter what people think because I'm having a blast writing this novel and I'm finding out things that I didn't know were possible. Like I never thought I could write 10 chapters of a novel and then still keep writing and make myself, you know, work and do that and I have. and. If you put your mind to it, it doesn't matter what other people tell you because no one's ever told me that I should write or I should be a writer and still it's my dream and I'm going to make it happen. So keep fighting towards your goals guys and don't let other people get you down. So yeah, that's what I have to say this week. Sorry for kind of a rambly video, but yeah, I'll see you guys next week for a better uh, update on the novel. So stay motivated, stay inspired, and of course stay happy. See you guys.